Kevin, KNC Fence Company. This is our PVC versus wood fencing. Uh, we install both, so we're not trying to sway you either way. Um, we're just trying to give you the accurate information so that you can make a better decision. Uh, wood fencing is a natural product, so it, it will do some shrinking and cracking and twisting and warping and sagging as it is drying out. And then over time, of course, you may need to replace boards and posts. And if you're going to maintain your investment, you'll want to seal and stain your fence every three to five years. If you hire a company in our area, usually the stain and seal is costing around six, seven dollars a foot. A PVC, PVC fence is not a natural product. It will not do any twisting, cracking, warping, uh, or any of that stuff on its own. Um, you, can, you still do have some maintenance where you need to clean the fence. You can get some unnoticeable ground movement and still get some sagging uh, around the gates. Uh, our experience is PVC fence will catch wind uh, more quickly. If you uh, have a lawnmower and it grabs a rock and really hits that fence hard enough, it can knock a hole in it. And of course, a PVC fence costs more to repair. Um, that's the difference between PVC and wood fence. We hope that's helpful as you're trying to make a decision. Uh, you can check out our wood and PVC fence page for more information. Remember, if you're looking for a fence, remember to watch our good questions to ask video. These are good questions to ask a, a fence contractor to help you get someone that you can trust. Uh, thank you for watching the video. Remember the name, KNC Fence Company.